partaking of what the ocean gives us and the health of the ocean is one of the most important things there is to all of us. We've done it our whole lives from generation to generation. One of the enjoyments of the world is one being with your family and the other is having good food to eat. I mean, the whole family gets to enjoy it. We take active part in the fishery and it's a way of life. It's important that it stays healthy. That's the most important thing. If you caught a fish, you were happy. But there's nothing like a good fresh halibut. This is an early circle hook is what this is. And how they came up with an idea is beyond me, but I'm sure glad they did. Generally, they were very elaborately carved. They were used all up and down the northwest coast. This is a bone barb in this case, which would have been traditional, you know. That determines the size of your halibut. That's a 20-40. I'm talking about 20 pounds to 40 pounds. This is the way it would sit in the water. You tied the bait right here. This goes down to the big rock and it just sits there. Your continuous line comes up to the surface and you'll have a buoy up there. They're an eating machine. They're not uh, going along and turning their nose up. Their, their whole purpose is to eat. Halibut, when he comes up, he actually comes up like this and goes in. And then he starts, he naturally puts the pressure on it and starts pulling it away. When that happens, he'll start towing it. And then I'll be up behind the log up on the beach watching with my binoculars, with my hobo coffee going in the can. And uh, as soon as I see my fin come up, I'm going to race out there with my six horse to retrieve him. They've probably been doing this for centuries. All of the wonderful food that comes from, comes from the ocean. This is one thing that works year-round. When your salmon are gone, you can go out and get a halibut.